Former Foreign Affairs Secretary Albert Del Rosario arrived this afternoon at the Manila International Airport earlier than planned. He was welcomed by former Ombudsman Conchita Carpio Morales. Del Rosario was supposed to attend a board meeting of First Pacific Company Limited in Hong Kong. He arrived at the Hong Kong International Airport around 7.40 this morning, but immigration authorities refused to allow his entry into the country. Uh, even to the last minute when the entry was being denied us, there was no explanation. I sit on the board of uh, First Pacific and uh, it calls for uh, by visiting Hong Kong for meetings about four or five, regularly four or five times a year. Immigration personnel took Del Rosario's passport and asked him to stay in a holding room for six long hours without giving any explanation other than it was just for an immigration reason. The former ambassador could not think of any reason for the incident other than as a retaliation for the communication he and Morales filed against Chinese President Xi Jinping before the International Criminal Court. I think clearly the bottom line is uh, I was being harassed or we were being harassed. And I think the reason might be uh, if, you, if you follow the trend, uh, the honorable ombudswoman who's here, she went through the same experience and the link uh, to that experience which uh, which provided which turned out to be consequential to us was the was the ICE communique that we sent to the uh, commitment morales shared his view other other reasons than bullying and retaliation i don't see any reason del rosario added that he is a diplomatic passport holder which means he has diplomatic immunity we should look into the possibility of uh, protesting uh, the failure of uh, the Hong Kong authorities to respect the, the, uh, the diplomatic passport. And this would be a, uh, a uh, violation of the uh, Vienna Convention. In a text message, Justice Secretary and Officer in Charge Minardo Guevara said the lesson derived from Morales' experience should have been clear to Del Rosario. But as OIC, he said he will request the DFA to find out the reason for Del Rosario's exclusion. Guevara's statement did not sit well with Morales. She said it is unfair to compare her experience with that of Del Rosario, considering that he is a diplomatic passport holder and she's not. For News 5, Maricel Halili. We are One News.